uh, and those that are still working and necessary people, God bless you, <laughs> keep working. Uh, if you want things, somebody's got to make things. Um, <clears throat> all right, what I am hearing at this point, uh, for the most part, very quiet this weekend, the different banking centers. Uh, I am hearing a lot of chatter that we are looking for the 15th through the 20th with a culmination on the 20th with the Iraqi Prime Minister announcing an international new rate. That is what I'm hearing now. Um, I am very disappointed that the Senate took off and left without a proper um, <clears throat> relief package. That has me a little concerned. Uh, so we're going to play wait and see over the weekend. Hopefully by Monday we'll have a really good idea of where we're at. I'm going to be digging. I'm back in the saddle now. I've got an obscene number of emails to, to catch up on. Um, I did look at quite a bit of uh, modeling and election modeling over the last couple of days to keep my mind active. And we'll, we'll dive into that away from just the, the, the news screen. Um, but that's what I'm hearing at this point. We don't have changes of rates. We don't have package deliveries. We don't have any of that yet. We do have travel X closing down in Canada and the U.S. operations here. Uh, just saying with the lack of travel that there isn't enough demand for their business and they can't keep the model open. So I'm not reading anything bigger into it than that. Um, but yeah, uh, I think that's about it on the news side.